It's time for Wonderful Adventure Now Korea, the flower shopping edition. We are here to get potted plants for the You're Here Cafe, and I'm really excited. So Susie and Lee have accompanied me here, and we're gonna pick out a million flowers. We've been prepared space for it, and I hope it don't get my nails ruined. Let's go. Oh my god, there are seriously so many beautiful plants here. It smells good. It smells amazing. Mm. It's like we should just come here to get away from the city air. <laughs> okay, so I think we've decided on the flower choice. I want it to be like a wild flower garden. So we're doing like maybe echinacea in the back and then something a little bit shorter in the front <laughs> and then a little bit lower in the front from there. The hunt continues. Okay, we would kill orchids if we got any. And these are like the water plants. Water plants. Oh, here we go, ivy. Ivy. Okay. Yay. Or if we can find morning glories, those are beautiful. It has like a flower that like opens up and looks like a circle, like a horn. My mom has a million of these, that's what she loves to get, and they just grow forever no matter what happens. We have birds nest in them and they're like, we're doing okay guys. I just hate the way they look. I'm not gonna get any. Not bark. Say, can I have Success! We have a merchandise wall where we're going to be selling the Talk to Me in Korean workbooks as well as some Ichikinchiku like special edition stuff. And in between is kind of like empty spots. So we want to be able to have like little cacti kind of around. I also like the ones that are like hanging. I'm not sure yet. One day, I'm gonna grow up through the cactus, and then I'm gonna murder you. That's not very nice. I'm gonna put that one back down again. Oh, this one's about to flower, and that's gonna have a tiny little flower. I shall name you Frederick. And now we're gonna have to name every single cactus that we have here. This is gonna be Hyanna, and this is gonna be Itook. T.O.P. and Frederick. They just bought a bunch of cactuses. And they're talking things like perennials. They're using words like perennial. I don't know anything about flowers. So we're looking for stuff to buy for our herb garden. One, because it smells incredible, right? To have like basil or lavender or rosemary beside you. And then the mint would be awesome because we could use it in some of our drinks, like for mojitos or for like yes. an aid, like a lime or lemonade. The problem is mint will overtake your garden. So we have to think of a way to grow a lot of mints, but in a controlled fashion. I'm thinking we get a bathtub. <laughs> <laughs> no, nope, just me. It's not rosemary? That's rosemary. Okay. That's, That's lavender. We've got mints. Apple mints. So they have different kinds. So this is apple mints, and they have the peppermint, and they also have a, another kind of mint. But what I like is that if you look at the leaves, you want to make sure there's not a single insect on it, because if you have one single tiny one, there's like 10,000 somewhere else. Almost every single mint pot I bought in Korea has been destroyed by insects. If we get a citronella plant, then we can keep the other insects away, and then we can even use like the clippings to kind of dry it. So for the patio oh, area. It smells nice. Yeah. All the stuff we got so far. So I don't know what these are, but we got them because they're cute. And then these are their little cactuses. Then we got some echinacea. And then Martina got two little lavender plants. And we didn't have to fold the seat down. Whoa, this car smells nice. nice. Oh, wow. So we already got plants yesterday. Today I'm gonna to be doing uh, planting of some of them because it's so hot that they're starting to die in their pots. I'm glad Simon came along to help me. Oh this. boy. Uh, that's enough for now. I just wanna to say, today was supposed to be the hottest day in Korean summer thus far. The day that I plan on planting in the garden makes me super grumpy. Hey, I like your hat.
no big deal or anything, but it kind of does this. So hot. Right? Notice the wild Martina in her natural habitat, puttering about, grunting with sticks, incoherently. She has things, she look, she smells something. It must be her own body odor. What could that be? No, wait, she just farted. 